Welcome to My Hero Origin. Hey, Mania. Hi. I got, I got your text. You said you needed my help with something today. Yeah. Uh. I I need help with my my quirk. What do you mean? Oh, did you did you eat salt again? No, 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 no. I didn't eat salt. I'm just having a hard time with it, kind of. I guess. I don't know. It, it's hard to explain, really. Hard time with it. Do you need help understanding it? Well, it, I understand it. It's just I have so many limits in place. I need to try to overcome them in a way, I guess. You want to reach a class ranking, don't you? <laughs> that obvious, huh? Well, you were marked pretty low. But that was just a physical test. It wasn't like quirk evaluation. Well, yeah, but my quirk is very unphysical, if you haven't noticed. I guess, but yours is one of the more unique ones as well in sense of... Like, no one can actually touch you. Yeah. And what did the teacher say? Quirks over time develop as well. They uh, they can evolve and do different things. Well, yeah, I know, but it's just like, there's just certain things that, like, I don't know. Uh, okay, okay, I understand. Um, Let's head down to my lab then. Are uh, you going to finish that? No. Mm. Okay. What? I'm hungry. I haven't eaten since two hours ago. All right. Let's see. Let me take a look. You see, right here, mm -hmm. actually, I took my own evaluation list. Mm -hmm. Actually, I took into account the abilities and the attributes of each person's quirk and put them in a scenario on, like, who would most likely, you know, actually be better in a fight. Instead of just focusing on just core attributes, such mm -hmm. as, like, strength, stamina, and all that stuff. And I actually placed you around the top ten, actually, of our class. What, really? Why? Mainly because your quirk is very strong, actually. Think about it. You were able to get around so many scenarios. Like, imagine, imagine you needed to chase someone who was running through a house. Who would be the best person to chase after them? Me. Exactly. You can face through anything. They try to drop a bookshelf to try to stop you. You just phase right through it. They try to close and lock a door behind them. You phase right through it. Yeah. Okay, that's fair. The, the, you would need to be very specific. And let's say into a fight, you get into a fight with, like, let's say, Mr. Number One David. Mr. Mm -hmm. Physically, I am buff. Mm -hmm. He actually would have trouble against you the most. Because he, he couldn't touch me. He couldn't touch you. And you could easily dance around him and be smacking him. Granted, you wouldn't be able to hurt him all too much. Yeah. But you would probably be able to outlast his quirk since we actually have no idea how long his quirk he can hold his quirk. Yeah. I mean, to be fair, I got a time limit on mine too, but. But you can control yours. You can fit. You can choose when to turn tangent, can't you? Mm-hmm. Uh. Okay. 
as an example. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Don't open those barrels, by the way. I specially made those to hold any attribute of salt in them. <sighs> That's why you're not feeling anything right now. Yeah, okay. Uh, let me see. Okay. This paper. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, uh, oh, yeah, this is my homework. To be a hero personal write-up. Mm -hmm. This is my homework, but we'll test it for now. Like, let's say, okay. When I throw the paper, I need you to turn tangent in that moment. What? Three... Two, one, go tangent. See? And you can easily turn that off, right? Yeah. yeah. Unlike David, who would need to... I'm sure it would take him more effort to turn, you know, solid. Yeah. Than it would be to... Than it would be for you to go ta tangent. Mm hmm And you don't feel that much strain when you do it, do you? N no, not really. Because it's become natural. You... From the stories you've told me, you fall through your floor quite a bit. <laughs> Meaning that it's just as it becomes a natural reaction for your body. Mm -hmm. Meaning that your body is adapted to your quirks extremely well. Mm. So I would imagine the best way to train your quirk is well, think fast. What? Like that your reaction time <sighs> and just being able to hold it i panicked but that was a good reaction time i didn't smack you in the face with a usb <sighs> think fast really okay stop it sorry you said you wanted help but the thing is you just need to work on your adaptability i guess Mm-hmm. So, question. Is turning invisible and turning tangent your only ghost abilities? Uh, no. I can uh, temporarily possess someone for a little bit, like two minutes. Okay. Actually, didn't even jot that down as one of your abilities. Okay. That might move you up your ranking, actually, a little bit. If anybody finds all these notes, I'm going to kill, I'm going to kill you. Oh, I put this on high every security. You couldn't what? even guess my password. Uh, Minecraft horse. The password real quick. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little more sophisticated than just Minecraft horse. Okay. Though I should probably close Minecraft. That horse would not be tamed. <laughs> Alright. Well, um... Yeah. Well, anyway... So, with that being said, how do you feel about... I guess we'll have to just generally train your quirk. I'm sure you will want to up your possession time, though. Yeah, I, I do. I guess I'm the only one that's going to volunteer for that. <laughs> I mean, if my brother wait, you don't abroad, I could test on him, but he's not here. Wait, you don't learn... Oh, wait, maybe I shouldn't be a good test subject. I, I don't learn secrets and information by possessing, if that's what you're worried about. There's something else that I wouldn't want you to find out, so let's not do that. Um, ooh, the fish! I'm not gonna possess a fish. I mean, why couldn't you? I'm not gonna possess a fish. Fine. We'll find something simple. Maybe I can make, like, a training dummy or something that can simulate, like, a human conscious. That could probably work. That sounds really, uh, advanced, though. Yeah, that's gonna be a simple thing to make, that's for sure. <laughs> I'm probably gonna have to ask Colin for some help then. He's he's better with programming than with than me. Is he? The Colin kid yeah. with the uh, the weird uh, hologram quirk thing. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. He, uh, he's better at programming. while I'm more better with hardware. Ah. Okay. So I maybe we can work on that one together. Yeah. Okay. Actually, maybe I wouldn't. There's something back home that I may be able to bring over here that I might be able to help. Huh. But, but yeah, no, um, your quirk. Mm -hmm. And, uh, yeah, on my own, on that listing down there. Mm -hmm. Uh, I have a, I'm still low ranked. Uh. Mainly because analyzing things on the field is not as 
good as you would think. I mean, as They're long as you can analyze like super quickly, I think you'd be okay. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, um, but yeah, no, the uh, quirk. It's just training. Um, okay, like okay. How about this? Every morning before you leave for class, you know how you always get up that hour before so we can eat and do all that stuff. Mm -hmm. Just uh, for that 30 minutes, or at least as long as you can, just try to be in intangible as you can. That way you can always, like, test to see how long you can keep it. I mean, I can keep being intangible for, like, 30 minutes. Okay. Then, uh... Hmm. I guess just improving it. Because I'm sure those tests are going to come up soon. That's going to that's gonna move, like, our rankings around. Mm-hmm. So we're going to need to be ready for those. I even hear rumors that there's going to be a test of a... There's going to be a big test coming up soon. Ugh, great tests. Yeah, I have no idea if it's going to be a written one, if it's going to be a physical one. I don't know. Yeah. And then and then I would, I just know Database has something up its sleeve for us. <laughs> I'm kind of excited for that, to be honest. Oh? Well, I mean, he's he's my favorite hero, so... He was also the he's also the one that you said is also giving you the most grief though. Yeah, cuz he's the one who wrote my recommendation. Uh, well, at least there's that. Yeah. Anyway, um should we go down and start analyzing your quirks a little bit more? We need to take more notes. Just give me like any minor details like do you feel like do you feel like you can't hear things as well? Can you not uh, see as good? That kind of stuff. Uh, I can't hear anything when my quirk is activated. Hmm. You know, there's that hero, there's that other kid, the one that uh, only uses sound vibrations that's here and all that, uh -huh. uses those special goggles. Maybe I can whip up something similar to, to like, his, so you can hear while you're in tangent. That, that'd be handy. Yeah, so let me see what I can whip up. I should have his notes from when I repaired his, so let's see. Database. Ugh. I wanted to talk to you. Can't you just talk to your father? Well, it, it's important. It's about being a hero. Uh, what is it? I... I'm gonna give up. What do you... What do you mean you're giving up? I... I just don't think I'm hero material anymore, and... I'd like you to rip up the recommendation you wrote me. I, I'm sorry, it's just... I don't think I'm hero material. Where is this all coming from, all of a sudden? Uh, it's just... Growing up, all the time, I've always been told my quirk's more suited to being a villain, and I just think they might be right. And I don't think I can be a hero with my quirk. Take it. But, but, what, what for? For not believing in yourself. I mean, I've had similar situations when I was growing up. I mean, I was bullied at one point because of my quirk. I was also told I wouldn't be a hero someday. But I kept working hard. And I ignored those bullies. And look at where it's gotten me. So you think I can be a hero too? Then? Anyone can be a hero. You... The random animal outside, a bird. If you believe hard enough and you work hard enough, you'll get there. Doesn't matter what your quirk is. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Are you sure you don't want to tell me what's been going on? Have you been getting bullied by some of your classmates? Well, no, no, not, not here. It's just... Everyone here is, is, is great, but it's just people from the past keep coming back, and they're just... I got hit the other day. Kid, By who? Um, a kid from my middle school. He kept calling me a villainess, and he said he would be a better hero than me, and I told him he wasn't a hero because of his actions, and he hit me. How old is this kid, by chance? Uh, he's about the same age as us, I think, like 15. Hmm. I can't charge him full assault. Yeah. 
Though Juvie is nice. Maybe I could use that to scare him. <laughs> Look, I don't know your whole situation. I mean, obviously I know your father better. But if people are giving you issues, let me know. I'll find some way to get rid of them in a sense. So that way they get off your back. Thank you. <laughs> so, middle school. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely something I want to forget too. <laughs> High school was a bit better though. I did make some nice friends. Even though the bullying kept up, I did have friends to have my back. What about yourself? Met any friends here yet? Yeah, I've, I've made a couple friends. Uh, Mari, Mario, Flex, he's really nice. <laughs> Good. Make sure to hold on to those friendships as long as you can. And don't ever let them go. I will. Now, is there anything else you need from me? Uh, no, thank you. Sorry. No, you're fine. Don't give up on your dreams. That's the last thing we want you to do. That's the last thing I want you to do. Okay. Keep working hard. And if you need anything, you know where to find me. Either here or at the police station. Okay, thank you. Um, I'll, I'll see you in class then. Mm -hmm. Good luck. Please. Oh, coming. Oh, hi. Hey there, Mania. <laughs> What's up? Come on in. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. I came. Sorry for interrupting. I hope I'm not disturbing. I came here to teach. Uh, Mar I came here to help Mari cook. Uh, help Mari cook. Yes. Oh. <laughs> ah. Yes. You see, after the last incident, I heard about the burnt cereal. I wanted to be a friend. <laughs> you know, just help out and be the friend and make sure they don't burn cereal again. <laughs> ah. Okay, well, she's actually not here right now. Oh. I think she went to go hang out with her sibling. Ah, uh, Ren. Yeah, they're nice. They're nice, so that makes sense. Mm -hmm. Means, did I maybe mess up the day a bit? I think that could be the case. I mean, was, was it tonight or was it tomorrow? I, I don't really remember now. No, I've been very... <laughs> I've been, you see, I've been very uh, hard at practicing my quirk at the training dome. Ah, uh, yeah, quirk practice. <laughs> yeah, how goes it with you? Uh, it's okay, I guess. I mean, Mario was throwing things at my face and telling me to think fast, so... I'm... That's a good training. You gotta think fast. I have to think really, really fast when I do my... When I do, you know, know this little stuff here. Boop. Oh, goodness. Yeah. Boop. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> you almost got stuck Ooh. on the wall for a second. That was a close one. That was... See, that's what I call a misfire. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta be careful with that. Yeah. Although, yeah, at least you didn't lose the mat. At least the wall didn't have a hole either after I popped in it. That happens sometimes. Ah. Uh, yeah, we Although probably would have gotten in trouble if that happened. Oh no, the school covers everything. The first day I came here, I had a letter that oh, the teacher has never had been informed, and I had a letter of uh, um, special occasions in case something like that were to happen. Right. So I think at least that would be covered. I'm not sure. It could be. It could also be a, that we have to f learn how to fix a wall or not. I had. <laughs> who, who knows? Who knows? So yeah, but so you were. So yeah, but you gotta be fast. And I'm sure. And you, but you aren't you already really fast at you know turning a whoosh ghost and then back normal again? Yeah, but after a while it gets kind of hard. Uh, yeah, I was I, doing it so much today because of Mario. I'm so exhausted. I can't do it again. Fair enough. Fair enough. Of still, quirk so cool. <laughs> I'm glad you think so. <laughs> yeah, it's a perfect quirk for a hero. Do you think so? Of course. Of course. Why wouldn't it be? Uh, I don't know because you can phase through walls to a safe and steal money. I, I don't know. I mean, look at my quirk. Uh, technically, I could literally just... If I saw a window like that, I could pop in. I could literally break... If I if I wanted to, I could break an enter to, into any home that had a window just by because I can see through. Mm -hmm. oh. But I don't think my quirk is meant for a hero. 
for a villain. It's meant for it can be a good for good for a hero. Mm, okay. Yeah. And yours is no different, at least in my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, yeah, Mar Mari's not here, so. <laughs> Excuse me, Adam. I am a little bit pickish, you know. <laughs> um, I don't actually think we have much in the fridge. <laughs> <laughs> oh no 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 no! I don't trouble yourself with me. Too worried by it. And do you want some strawberries covered in chocolate? Oh, that sounds good. Yeah, here you go. Oh, yum. Yeah, we mainly just got the essentials: bread, cheese, butter, milk. I need to go shopping. Um, mm. <laughs> you're so good. Yeah. Hmm. Remind. You know what? Remind me to come. Up. I'll gotta remind. I. You know, I gotta remind that. I'll be back with. One day I'll come over with a cake. I'm. I make a lot of food. You know. Maybe I'll even come over and make dinner one night, you know. Then we can all have a l fun time together. Yeah, I'll have to find another chair. I think we only got three. Or just move one of the ah. stools over to the table. <laughs> <laughs> that could be the case as well, yeah. Uh, so, yeah, but if I were to cook, what would you want me to cook? Look, I do a lot of varieties. I've recently tried to do ramen as well. It's been good so far. Oh, ramen. Like, yeah. It's a little... Like actual ramen and not the in the package ramen? No, 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 no. I want to I wanna do the best quality for my friends. And they are so kind to actually provide for, and the school and our and uh, their money, I mean, my roommates' money and the school's money. Only we can. I, they are actually so kind to provide with the ingredients since I can't exactly buy a lot, lot myself. So I. So the least least I can do is try to make it uh, as a, as original as possible. Yeah. Or as authentic. Authentic is the word. Yes. Yeah. Well, I think. If need be, we'll go food shopping together because <laughs> we need to go eventually. <laughs> That could that could be the case. Oh, then tell me. Then then tell me. Then then I can ha uh, buy in for whatever you would want that day. <laughs> uh huh. Okay. You know, I've been here before and I've seen Mario's room, but I've never but I've never really seen yours or is it Mario that lives here? Yeah, Mario. Yeah, I've never yeah, seen you. Yeah, Mario, You're... Mario, the M Squad. That I... ah, now the sign makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty, so this one's mine. Ooh! <gasps> is that? Uh, is that what I think it is? No, it's it's not what you think it is. It, but it, it's th that looks like your hero outfit. It, it, it's not. You know we're not allowed to keep our hero outfits in in our dorms, right? Oh, oh! So it's just a, so it's just a very fancy outfit then. My mom sent it to me, but I didn't end up using it. Uh. So. Oh, okay, your mom. Oh, is that her? Yeah, that's my mom. Ah, you even have a little baby brother. Yeah, that's Daisuke, but we just call him Dai. Ah, he looks so cute. It's really funny when we lose him at the park and we're just screaming, Dai! <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, you even have a fancy bed. Yeah. And a nice posters. Oh, Spyro? I l yeah. I've heard of, I've heard good things about the game, but I've never tried it. Yeah, it, it, it's a really nice game. I like yeah. it. Oh, and you even have a computer? Yeah. I wish I knew what it was like to have a computer. Never had oh. one. Oh, it, it it can be a pretty big distraction if you're trying to do homework. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's yeah, that's never been. The most things I've ever owned. I mean, this is the first phone I've ever owned. That was given to me by the school. Oh wow. Yeah. Mm. You see, at home, my family didn't make. We don't have a lot of money, you know. But it that doesn't. Yeah. It's not really that the math. And I just want to, but they always been so kind to me and wanted to give me stuff of my parents and wanted to make sure I could li fulfill my dream. Mm -hmm. So they even paid off all the parkour practice I went to. Oh, wow. And I yeah. know that can be kind of expensive sometimes. Yeah, parkour and free run, but they were willing to do it anyway. Well, that's that, yeah, they're the best parents anyone could ask for. Mm. So you want to yeah. see Mario's room? I mean, he's not he... here, but <laughs> I mean, as long as maybe a little. As long as we don't touch anything. I mean, a little sneaky couldn't hurt. Ah, oh, this is a small room. No, Wait, what's this? Really what? It, it's his little lab, where he does all of his mechanical thingies. I get. Okay, I knew he was what. Wow. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Yeah. This is so techy. Yeah, it is pretty techy. That's why we're not gonna touch anything and we're gonna leave. 
Okay, okay, okay. Because if we touch anything and he knows he's gonna kill one of us, most likely me. But aren't you all? But aren't, but aren't you already? No, not really. Okay, spiritually. No, no. <laughs> Stop right now. <laughs> Ah, you come on, you know. Ah, come on, you like them a little bit. Admit it. No, puns okay. are horrible. <laughs> ah, but you, but you heard Miss Mood swing. Ink puns are good on the battlefield. <sighs> Only because they make your enemy face palm. <laughs> They'll have to. F yeah, that's a great way they can face it. <laughs> you no, know, I'm just gonna leave my own freaking dorm. I'm just gonna go jump off a cliff. No, yeah. So, okay. but, and, but, so yeah. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll stop, I'll stop, I'll stop. <laughs> okay, thank you. <laughs> yeah, but you have a really nice storm here in your room, and you have all some nice rooms. I like them. Yeah, we, we like them too. <laughs> so, uh, ooh, actually, hmm? but yeah. Ooh, actually, have you, did, speaking of before with parkour and all that, there's one thing I've always wanted to try and do, you know? Yeah. What's that? With parkour, cause you see, I've been very good at parkour. In fact, in fact, just before I got to Monarch, a little, just a little under eight months before I got to Monarch Academy, mm -hmm. I actually got the license to tr to train other people in parkour, at least the basics. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I've been doing it since I was, I think I was eight. Ah, it's been quite a while then, huh? Yeah, yeah, I've almost. I'm, I practiced for almost hmm, eight years, I believe. Seven? No, seven years. Seven years. Yes, seven years. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm not good at math. Yeah, and neither am I, to be honest. But I've always seen when I practice some parkour here, there. I always saw at the police station they had that really fun-looking obstacle course. I always wanted to try it, but no, no public is allowed on that course, of course. <laughs> yeah. But I want to try it so badly. Yeah, that course is actually pretty difficult. I know, that's why I want to try it. I want to challenge myself. Because my usual runs is just like on skyscrapers and other buildings like that. Okay, maybe not that difficult then. If you're doing it on like skyscrapers and stuff. I mean, it's a special license I have as well. But plus, unlike most people who does parkour, I can kind of save myself with a shortcut, you know? Oh, yeah. Uh, so that's maybe why I've been allowed to do it a bit more. Plus, I need to. Plus, if before I can do it on skyscrapers, I need to, to ask the building owners if that's all right. Sometimes I've only got rejected like nine out of ten times. That's a lot of times. Yeah, but I was determined to ask them anyway, repeatedly. <laughs> okay. Yeah, but anyway. Ooh, and speaking of also quick. I haven't told many people about this, but do you want to know what what else I can do with my quirk? What? What can you do? You see, I, I you already know my little basic shortcut and all that, right? Mm -hmm. I could actually, if I wanted to as well, well, I could actually take a short, take you with me through the shortcuts. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, but no more than two people. I mean, that's a, and it that's depends. a good way to save people, though. It is. That's why I want to also make sure I can save people. You know, it's always nice when you feel like, like when you can do more with your quirk. Like you, like I know you, like but you already told me all about your quirk. You know, you can face through walls, you can go invisible, mm -hmm. all and all that. Yeah. But it's still so cool. <laughs> <laughs> but if you ever feel, but tell you what, if you ever feel like you wanted to help, I know, as you said, you wanted to help with the quirk. Like just say so. I'm happy to help out with whatever you would want to help have help with. Okay. Plus, it would be a great way, way to, ooh, I could practice my quirk and see if I could manage to, you know, oh, I would stand here, you would be there, yeah, I would try and uh, go shortcut to you and see if I could touch you, you could try and go intangible before you, before I touched you, yeah, great, re great training, you know, oh yeah, great, great reflex training, yeah, yeah, although I'm sometimes curious, can you do anything else with your quirk or is that all you can do, I'm um, just curious, I can temporarily possess other people, so like a like what they say ghosts can do. Uh huh. Oh, that sounds really cool. Yeah, it also kind of depends on how like strong-willed the person is, though. Ah, uh, okay, 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 okay. Like if they're like a willing subject, super easy. If they're trying to fight me, it's gonna be a bit more difficult. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. Often all that. <laughs> what is it? Yeah. 
I guess you'll fix that. But if you ever need help with that as well or anything else, I said, just guess me. I'm willing. I am willing to help a friend out with whatever. Mm -hmm. So wait, if you were to do that, could you even could you get the person to do what that you want them to do? Um. Yeah, but it's limited because I can't make them use their quirk. So. Ah. Okay. Okay. Because I would tell. Yeah. By the way, the same thing would go. Uh, if I try to use my shortcut with you, by the way. I keep forgetting to warn people about that, but I kind of also can make them dizzy and nauseous through when they go for the shortcut, because that's well, what happens. Well, yeah, I mean, it kind of sounds logical, you know, because you're going from one place to another without, like, your body registering it, so. Yeah. Your body's gonna be like, whoa, where'd we go? What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I don't, I'm just gotten, I think I've just gotten used to it at this point because I've used it for so long. Well, it's your quirk. You're gonna have to get used to it. <laughs> yeah. Imagine if I just kept teleporting, oh, what happened? Where? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah. Anyway, I can see them. It's getting, oh, it's a little bit late. Uh, Aiden, all that. Late. I, yeah, I should probably head back. Yeah. I'll tell Marnie yeah. you stopped by, though. Yeah. F will do. Thank you, and I and tell my and also tell Mario also said hi. Of course, yeah. he's just a, he's just a great friend. Is in one year, yeah. so okay. <laughs> be safe. Thanks. Be safe, and if and if you ever need help help for anything from a friend, I'm always there. Just so you know. Hi, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> bye -bye. See you, Mania. Bye bye.